Before the video starts, I want you to leave a like on this video, subscribe to my channel, and ring the bell so you'll get notified when I release new videos. And also leave a comment as well. Hey guys, Cool Domino here. This is, will be a video on my new system I just created. If you're an Instagram follower and you saw my little sneak peek on my Instagram, um, this is kind of what's going to relate to right here. So, um, yeah, I, I moved the system as you see here if you have been following my Instagram. So, as you see here, I have it now attached over here my WR100 right here. I tested this with my WR120 and my WR300. The WR100 and WR300 are the two best radios for this here. So basically I connected the wire to the external alert. And by the way, in case you're wondering what the warning is, um, let me get this focus for you. In case you're wondering what the warning is, it's a dust storm warning right there. Which is pretty cool. So yeah, the wire comes out of the external alert right here. That goes up into here and into this back box right here. That now goes up to conduit and to my STI mini controller alarm. I will eventually switch that to the blue. I have a 9 volt battery in there right now and I have the two wires connected to the alarm switch, basically. So what I figured out, when this radio sounds its alert tone, the external alert completes a circuit, basically closing a relay. I could go ahead and demonstrate that for you right now. So if I go ahead and go into that, that. Just like that. So yeah. I made it so it sounds for um, 15 seconds and then it will continue to flash for the next 30 seconds, oh, no, sorry, 60 seconds basically. So yeah, I tested this, again I tested this, I tried the WR120, Not doesn't work as well, um, it does work but just not as well, um, like it starts sounding after the alert tone is over with, actually I'm going to go demonstrate that right now for you. I go into my other room right here. And go ahead and grab my WR120. This one also has the dust storm warning on it, as you see. It's actually two of the mission. So yeah, if I bring this over here, just like that. And then what I do is I try to disconnect that this without sending off the alarm. And then if I put it into this here, the external port. Sorry, that's not focused for you. And I just set it off. Give me a moment while it cycles through. So I'm gonna. So that's gonna cycle through. I'll be right back. Eventually. All right. So I finished doing its cycle. Now I come down here to my WR120. I'm gonna lower the antenna real quick just so. You could get a better idea on what's going on. I'm gonna hold this next to the device so you can see exactly what's going on. Sorry if that's not focused though, I'll try to focus it for you as best as I could. Yeah, I really need autofocus. I'm planning on getting another camera sometime. So I'm gonna hold it right here. Sorry that's not focused, but it's good as good as I could do. So we're just going to alert test. Like that. I don't know you can see that, but it's an alert test right now. Okay, okay. and I'm going to go ahead and hold it right there so you can see. And I'm going to press the button. Uh, not that button, this button. As you saw there, when I started the alert test, the light flashed once. But when I stopped it, it just started sounding like what it's doing right now. I'll go ahead and put the cover back on. Almost in the 
afternoon. Okay, so if you ever want, if you want to do this, um, it's actually quite simple. Um, I do not recommend using the auxiliary power for the alarm, though. Like the 12 or 24 volt, I recommend you just using the 9 volt, though. And the WR100 and the WR300 are your key radios for this, though. So, yeah, you want to use these radios because we go call it this one. And that one over there, basically, is what you want to use. Yeah, sorry for the mess. I haven't got the chance to clean that up yet. So, yeah. That's pretty much it. The alarm's just finished cycling. So, yeah. Dust storm warning. Um, the alarm went off for that. First time the National Weather Service has issued a warning that sets off the system. It's pretty cool. So, yeah. That's pretty much it. Um, this is The name of the alarm is an STI mini controller. Um, I highly recommend this alarm. I really like this alarm right here. Um, even if you're a collector or a business, I still recommend it because I really like this alarm. Um, it's not the brightest alarm. That's the only downside I have with it, but other than that, it's a really good alarm. It has 32 different tones, um, and it, it, it come in white, obviously here. They come in white, blue, green, red, and amber. I'm going to try to get all this color sometime. I might put a blue one up there or an amber one sometime. That would be kind of cool. So, yeah. Thank you for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you in the next video.